Okay guys, this is the uh, video about how to make a fruit bowl out of a record. So what I've done, I'm not sure if you can see, let's see, I've already given it a really good uh, acrylic varnish. So the thing is what I'm going to show you is I'll be putting uh, this in the oven it's a dog bowl and I have two so what I'm going to do is put the record on top and the oven it'll droop a little get a little soft then I take the other one I place it on top like that and push it down like that and then you'll see that the wavy pattern of the bowl is very uh, like syn synchronic I don't know if that's an English word but you get these really beautiful pleats all in the same uh, same distance because I've seen some people make uh, these fruit bowls and they have some big big wavy things and then a little bit and then it's a little bit you know not not like I imagine a fruit bowl to be because I think you do have to have those wavy things going all around and uh, exactly spaced to make it really beautiful. So right now I'm looking, gotta get my flashlight to see how warm the oven is. Let me see. Yeah, it's uh, it's up there at about, I put it at a hundred Celsius and that's gonna do the trick. So I'm gonna pop it in there right now. So I'll show you down there. Woo, it's hot in there. And the dog is already looking at why I'm taking her bowls. Okay, I'll get you guys down. Sweetie, come on. Uh, I'll get you off there a, a little bit. And I'll show you. There it is in the oven. Can't see that well. But it's already starting to droop a little bit. One side. And I might give it a little air. Oh yeah, there it goes. Right now I'm not sure if it's in the middle, but we'll see. There's my little dog, Nooky, baby. Oh, there it goes. See how it already droops? It's not even been in there for more than, I think, about two minutes. I don't even think that long. So um, I'm going to put you guys back up on the tripod, and I'm already going to take it out because that's more than enough. Let me put it back so you can see something. Yep. Then I have to get my gloves. And don't worry about the oven, guys, because this oven is only used for uh, polymer clay and uh, stuff like this. I have uh, one of those microwaves that do a lot of things. Yep. Oops. There it goes. See how droopy it is? Get the bowl. You got to do this real quick and press it down like that then get the whole thing put it under the under some cold water sorry I can't show you that's it close the oven There you have it inside the uh, the bowl. It's already hard. See that? See how pretty? Let me put it under the cold water again. That's it. 
And the thing is that I didn't, um, I didn't get it to be totally centered. And that's what you really have to watch out because you want the, um, the label of the record, you want that in the middle. But other than that, I'll take you guys outside so you can see it better. But it's going to be like that. It's not going to come undone or anything else. So we'll take that outside. It's some beautiful weather outside. The dog wants to go outside. Here you go. Okay. I'll show you right there. See how pretty it is? And the only thing that is um, that I should have done better is center it better. But you get the idea. Uh, a lot of people ask, you know, how do you do that? So I just thought I'd show you. But it has a, a really nice shape to it. Just like that. I did paint uh, the inside just a little bit, just to show that you can. Didn't uh, do a, a varnish on that. You can see how uh, the water sort of leaves marks. But, you know, if you're going to do one of these, like someone uh, said on uh, my YouTube channel, you shouldn't be putting uh, food in this. That's, uh, I don't think I'd like to do that. If you want to have it just as a bowl, you know, to put on some, uh, some table, that's my garden. Still nothing going on in the garden. We need some uh, more sun before the leaves are really going to pop out. Okay. There are all my paintings. <laughs> okay. So you get the idea, I hope, um, that when you have two of these bowls, they're not that expensive. So you put the record on top, put it in the oven, and as you really just saw, it only takes like one or two minutes. Then you press the other one on top and you get these uh, nice wavy patterns. But I would make sure that you center it really well because, you know, now it's a bit, you know, one side is a bit taller than the other. So that's not uh, really beautiful, but I guess it's okay. You could put neat stuff in it, I think. Yeah, you could put some really cute stuff in there, like some potpourri or, I don't know, all sorts of stuff. Easter eggs, you could put those in there because you have to peel them before you eat them, right? So that'd be cute. So thank you for watching and I hope you make beautiful bowls out of records because it's a lot of fun. Okay, so I'm going to be doing one more video today because I have to do a huge clean up upstairs. And I'm doing one more video. Uh, I think I'll be pouring a 40 by 40 in one of those big ones. Because I'm really looking forward to that. And that's it. So thank you all. See you in the next video.